why it is retarded for the sheeple to believe that God is anything but a man. First of all, everything you know about God came from someone else with an agenda, and that agenda is making them benefit and you not benefit. Okay. So the people with the agenda who have spent, caused the entire world to suffer are the ones who told you all about God. And what did they tell you? They told you, be careful of false prophets. So, did they say, be careful of false clouds? No, false prophets. So right away, that tells you that they are worried of you meeting a prophet-like person. So they got you, they got you um, upset about false prophets. Hang on a second, I gotta put this in pause. So they got you afraid of the false prophets, and uh, yet they have no intention of protecting you from evangelists or uh, people that are stealing money from you, or the guy with the rapturing. Now the guy that there's several people that came forward and said there was going to be a big rapture, and did they protect you from them? No. Nope. Did they? Did you protect yourself and didn't care about false prophets? No. So, there's a lot of things that's going on that that's connected to the fact that God is a man. Or, simply that you should at least consider that God is a man, not a cloud. First of all, you're made in his image. And you look nothing like that cloud. Right? Let's add some more. Oops. Cloud, rain, sun, you're made in his image, so therefore you must be, so he must be like that. Now they spend all their time <coughs> praying to something at the hill of Golgotha called a Golgothan feces demon. And the Golgothan feces demon happens to be the same last name as the queen. Elizabeth Gotha. That's the hill Jesus died. And there's a gold Gotha and Jesus demon. They're really just concerned about angels and demons because there's fallen angels. And my dogs are acting up. This is what they do when I have. <coughs> Hang on. And yeah, they're consumed with the angels and demons. And they're consumed they want you to be consumed with aliens. That's just Israelians. And so in Israel there's a hill of called Golgotha. That's where the Illuminati were formed, and that's the Queen's last name. So you got your dude who's. So they said, beware of the false prophets, and you got the dude who fits the uh, bloodline, birth date, start time, name, behavior from his past life. They do not want you looking at him. So they want to make sure that you absolutely do not look at him now they want you to wait for him to come in the clouds so but they want you to beware because there might be two or three or four or five false cloud choices to pick from so you're looking up nope that's not him nope that's not him, because you're supposed to beware. Beware of false prophets. Nope, that's not him. Anybody can come in the clouds. Any of these God-type creatures can come in the clouds. And, of course, every knee will bend. You'll be horrified. You see something gigantic in the clouds that can smite the whole earth down. You can, you can uh, basically do all kinds of crimes all your life, and then suddenly every knee will bend, and then you will bend to the cloud and be sorry. And, ah... Uh, Trumpets go off and harps and shit and suddenly, you know, you're sorry and that's why and now suddenly you accept God? And you and does that sound reasonable to you? Even after you've been troll, uh, taught by the enemy and controlled with your mind, flicker rate and stuff like that? Does that sound reasonable to you? No, God is far more simple than that. He's not going to be one of many false clouds. He's a man. This was made by angels. This is the pyramid. 
and what happened is this was the altar to the Lord, but rejection of the capstone is why they do a curse at you. This is a rejection of the capstone, because they don't want this. It's a curse at you. They don't want it. All their all their symbology has a unfinished pyramid. Okay? Now, that's Egypt. That's why it's Isis. Ra. L. Because it is Egyptian. That's why your snake, I mean your Isis dollar sign, your snakes on the health symbol, you got your snakes on the health symbol, you got your obelisks, you got your Star of David. I've already done one of these drawings before that got me my channel banned. I oh, know I got the video removed. Beware of false prophets. No. They are saying beware that there will be someone who will fit the bill of exactly who God is. What is God? God is a man. Ephest. Of the laws of vibrational energy, which is L O V. God is manifest. That's what we are. That's why we are made in God's image, because we too are manifest, made in God's image. And they hate you, because they are this. They are soulless. They've already given their soul away, and they want your soul. They print the money. The Federal Reserve prints the money. These are the same enemies who taught you religion, the same enemies who taught you law, the same enemies who taught you science, the Zions, the same enemies who taught you uh, every kind of thing that you live with and right now, they taught you. Now they print that money. That's worth nothing. That's worth zero. Just air. They only care about him. Now let's go to a new one because I want to do the Mon Goal. Okay? Gaul. Because I'm doing this with my mouse. Golgotha. Golgotha. That's the Queen's last name. The Queen of England. That's the place the Illuminati were formed. That's where Jesus died. The cross. Golgotha. Demon. Monarchy. Money. Monopoly. And... Genghis Khan, Mongol, Turks, Khazars, Ashkenazis, and um, obviously Demon, we already said that. But it is this Temple of Solomon. And that's where your son comes from. Solomon. Son of Man, or, yeah, Son of Man, or whatever the hell it is. Just Solomon. Just more Mongol, Gothin, Monarchy, Demon, Isis, Ra, El, Israelians, and you will find those aliens on the throne. Queen of England, she's got a Star of David on the back of her throne. Rothschilds, Red Shield, Blood Cross, Red Cross, all owned by her. So, uh, there is no false prophets coming in the clouds. It is Brian, the life of Brian, Brian Leonard Go Lightly Marshall, conceived April 6th in our time, which happened at the exact same time of April 6th of the Shroud. The Shroud of Turin is not the face of a 33 year old Jesus, it is the old man today. Brian is the Shroud of Turin. Now, that's all I can tell you guys. It's about reincarnation. Google Jesus reincarnation. There's no false prophet coming who's going to rip you off and protect you or please the government or please the monarchy. There is just one man they hate. That is the reincarnation of Jesus. You do not die. That is the message. In Egypt, they don't even have a word for death. They don't have a word for death. It's all about the pyramid, the altar to the Lord, the four corners of the pyramid 
One of them is called Draco. That's what they're concerned about. That's why they say Israel is the cornerstone. Israel is the cornerstone. No, the capstone is the rejection of Christ. That's why they wear caps. That's why your name is in caps. That's why cities of cemeteries are called capitals. It's about the rejection of the capstone. That is the life of Brian Leonard Golightly Marshall. And this is just a hack video, but it's best I could do it at the moment. Thanks.